Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name's Jason and this is going to be a relaxation session. <laughs> I'm trying to think of uh, what I was going to do then. But it looks like it's going to be another relaxation session. Yet another one. Out of all many many that I've done I've done hundreds of relaxation sessions and before I start I just like to just quickly say thank you to all of those who have recently newly subscribed to my YouTube channel and uh, there's been a nice little influx and I appreciate it thank you and also thank you to all of those uh, regulars of mine that uh, commented on my vlog posts even though the vlogs have now gone from my channel um, the you know I did I read everything and I replied to all of them and I do appreciate your time uh, leaving comments and so I get into doing this new hypnosis session and before before you start listening to the session before you start kind of closing your eyes and letting yourself go and all that stuff it's important that you get yourself into a comfortable position lying down sitting in a chair whatever physical position suits you best but it's also worth remembering and this is really really important that you also remain aware of how your physical body is and I do continuously bring you back to focusing on how you are because hypnosis is focus um, the main reason I said that is because you know, for example, if someone uh, gets so relaxed and they drift off and their neck is like that, for example, their neck is in a weird position, even though they feel completely comfortable and completely relaxed, you know, they might come out at the end of the session with a, like a bit of a weird neck, you know? They might uh, not feel as relaxed as you're supposed to. So the whole point of this, and I know that there's a lot of people watching this that might have physical discomfort or pain or chronic pain or something like that. Again, it's very important that you look after yourself and you're kind to yourself during these sessions so that if you need to move your body, whether laying on your stomach if you're laying on your back or more, you know turning over the other side laying on your left or even if it's if you're sitting up to just getting up and lying down pausing this or something it doesn't matter whatever you need to do keep yourself comfortable because there's no point otherwise as this is a relaxation session the most important thing is your physical comfort and also obviously your mental comfort as well so I hope it didn't come across as me telling you off but you know I, I really think it's important that you look after yourself when you do these sessions and even though I'm on YouTube or, or on SoundCloud or iTunes um, it's still a real thing that we're doing here. It's still um, therapy or whatever you want to call it. But it's not just entertainment, really. I mean, it is kind of entertainment, but it's not, not something you're just going to watch and have a giggle at unless you want to just look at my beard and laugh at that, which I don't blame you. I'm going to make a lovely Santa Claus one day. So I've already got the belly for it, but you can't see that because I strategically placed the camera 
just below my chest so you could look at me and think well maybe I'm quite slim <laughs> I'm not <laughs> so if we get ready to do this relaxation session and I'm going to talk softly you may need to have the volume up a little bit higher to hear me than you would on a, a regular session but you could just try having it as a normal level but then giving it more attention focusing on my voice more because that's what this is about it's about you focusing on the words that I say which then result in you feeling more and more comfort physically and emotionally as those tensions in your body and in your mind just melt away drifting away like a I get like a big hot air balloon, you know, it's like you're packing all that tension into the hot air balloon and just watching it drift away. That's kind of what it's like when you listen to my voice and allow yourself to let go. So I'd like you to close your eyes if it's safe for you to do so. As if you haven't already done so. I'm. I have a tendency if I watch these kind of things, I do close my eyes pretty much straight away. Even if I was listening to uh, an audio, a lecture, university lecture online, or uh, even if I'm watching a lecture kind of in person, I, can't, I quite like to close my eyes because it takes away the distraction of the visual side of things and then allows me to really focus my ears on not just the words that I'm saying, but also you can notice the resonance of my voice, the the tone, the, the different changes in um, volume, even not, not like massive changes in volume, but maybe, you know, just as we do normally talk, we, you know, it's not just one sound the sound, you know, stays the same the whole time. It's changing and it's going up and down and the volume, the tone, the timbre and all the different other words to, to do with uh, listening to things and sounds. And then you can listen to the actual words and noticing specific words that maybe resonate with you and certain words to perhaps actually have an effect on how you feel. This is natural to have this. We all have reactions to specific words and we all can relate to certain ideas which in turn affect how we physically feel and emotionally changing our minds and in a way heals our minds and opens our minds up so as to let go of that clutter that limited thinking that was there before just like a dumper truck you know with all this garbage in the back and just lifting up and letting it all just fall out, all that rubbish, all the pointless stuff, all the stuff that's no longer needed. Let it all just drop down into the dust pit, into the rubbish pit. You can just drive off and leave that there. Which then gives your mind more space to enjoy being you. More space to just get in touch with the feelings that you have knowing that you can experience a sense of oneness you know a sense of connection 
within yourself so the the body is not just the body and the mind is not just the mind you know it's connected we all know that your body and your mind is connected you know, it's a thing called a neck it connects your brain the spinal cord connects your brain to your body as does you know your neck as well and we know that anyway but sometimes we act uh, you know in the past as if it's something is separate two separate things when actually one affects the other the brain affects the body and the body affects the brain your thinking affects how you physically feel and how you physically feel affects how you think about how you feel and how you emotionally feel and your responses so there's a continuous wave of responses and reactions may be occurring between your body and your mind so when you relax one part of your body your mind also relaxes but so does another part of your body because every part of the body is connected some parts are connected obviously by the muscle groups you know so you've got your hands and your fingers obviously they're connected by the muscles by the bones so when you move your hands and your fingers you could feel that connection you can feel them relax because they're connected you can also feel that relaxation spreading to your wrists because of course that's also connected and your arms as well including your elbows all the way up to your shoulders it's all connected through the muscles through the bones through the tissue through the veins in your arms but also through the skin which means your palm of your hand is connected to your knee because it's the same skin it's the same layer of skin that covers your entire body connects everything together and then you've got your spinal cord which connects everything together everything is connected in some way or other between all the different parts of your body and it's an amazing thing because it means that you can feel relaxed in your left hand and also you can stimulate relaxation in your right leg causing your lower back to feel relaxed and calm and loose which in turn because it's literally connected your hips also really relax and feel really loose because the lower back and the hips are a part of you that you use so much so active from the minute you're born lower back every time you move your body your lower back is being used the muscles and the spine and your hips when you turn your body when you walk just for balance giving yourself an opportunity to let that part of your body just let go and just noticing where in your brain that part of your body is connected to and it might seem like a strange question to ask but when I think of my lower back when I actually focus on my lower back I can feel that in my brain I can't necessarily point it out with my finger I'm trying to but I can feel a sensation in my brain connected with my lower back and that sensation in my brain is relaxing 
not just my lower back but also my brain. It's just letting go and by focusing on it my brain knows that my lower back requires relaxation and calmness and deserves to feel completely comfortable. So I'm just wondering as you focus on your stomach, where do you feel that? So as you really focus on it, where do you feel that in your brain? It's just quite an amazing feeling just to realize that it's like stars in a night sky and you can just see it light up. It's like looking in the sky at night and you can see the one shining light which is connected to your stomach. And the more you focus on that light, the more relaxed your stomach becomes. That fine tuning, that fine focus has such an impact. In fact, not just an impact, but an unpacking the tensions that were there before, allowing your stomach to feel more relaxed. As you focus on the back of your neck, the muscles in the back of your neck, notice where in your brain you can see that connection, that light, like looking into the night sky, clear, seeing the stars, and you can see this particular connection bright and shining. And notice how relaxed the back of your neck becomes the more you focus on that light. It's quite tingly, it's sending tingles down my spine. It's like my whole, my spine seems to be just lighting up with, it's like messages of deep relaxation being sent to all the other parts of my body. So now you can just focus on the lights without focusing on your body. Focus on the individual lights and notice what part of your body feels relaxed when you focus on that individual light shining brightly whether it's your knees, your feet, your hands, your eyes, your mouth, your jaw, your chest, your back, your hands, your arms, shoulders. Just notice each light and just focusing on them and noticing as each part of your body becomes more looser, becomes more calm. I'm just really getting a sense of connection. really a sense of not needing to do anything because everything is being done automatically. Every part of you is deeply relaxing 
automatically. that sense of calmness in your mind, the sense of acceptance towards yourself and your ability to just observe these feelings of deep relaxation in all the parts of your body and both your mind And you can really enjoy this sense of complete emptiness a feeling of total calmness with nothing happening you really realize that no matter what goes on around you, you have this ability to relax so completely. so easily this sense of letting go feels so natural Just being aware of your body, just being on 
aware of the calmness, the stillness of your mind. as we move towards the end of this relaxation session, I'd like you to remember that you can feel this relaxed and maybe even more relaxed in the future just by watching this video or listening to this audio. You will naturally and instantly drift into a deep healing sense all over comfort in every part of your body and completely relaxed in every part of your mind. allowing you to look forward to a future of calmness, relaxation and happiness, feeling wonderful to be you. Remembering to fully accept yourself. Remembering to fully love yourself. And remembering that you can feel completely safe. And I'm going to count to three. And when I get to three, you can open your eyes, feeling completely relaxed and at the same time you can be full of energy feeling like you've slept for eight hours solid so you're full of energy looking forward to the rest of the day one Two, feeling more aware of your surroundings, getting more in touch with how relaxed you physically feel, remembering that every time you hear my voice or see my videos, you will naturally and instantly feel completely relaxed. Three, and you can open your eyes and enjoy the rest of the day feeling wonderful. And I'll see you next time. Bye.